if interest is compounded continuously then at what rate the principal would triple itself in eight years so let's say there is an amount p which has been deposited in a bank for a period of eight years now at the end of eight years we want the total amount to be three times the principal which was deposited at the beginning of eight years now the interest is being compounded continuously and we need to find out the rate r1 at which the principal would triple itself at the end of eight years now we know that for cases where interest is being compounded continuously amount is equal to principal multiplied by the constant e to the power of n1 r1 by 100 where n1 is the number of years and r1 is the rate of interest per year so amount is equal to three times principal so 3p is equal to p e is equal to 2.71828 and 1 is 8 years so 8 multiplied by r1 divided by 100 so here p gets cancelled with p so 3 is equal to 2.71828 to the power now 8 divided by 100 is 0 0.8 0.08 times r1 now we can use logs here so log 3 is equal to 0 0.08 r1 log 2.71828 now here we have used the concept which says log of x to the power k is equal to k log x so x is 2.71828 and k is 0.08 r1 so our expression became 0.08 r1 multiplied by log of 2.71828 so let me pull my calculator here so log 3 so 3 log so this is 0.477 so 0 0.477 is equal to now you have to find log 2.71828 so 2.71828 log so this becomes 0 0.08 r1 multiplied by 0 0.434 so we have to multiply this by 0 0.08 so 0 0.08 and this becomes 0 0.0347 so or 0 0.477 is equal to 0 0.0347 r1 so or r1 is equal to 0. 477 divided by 0 0.0347 so let's find this out so 0.477 divided by 0 0.0347 so this becomes 13.746 percent so r1 is equal to 13.746%. So this is the rate of interest that we were trying to find out.